and welcome back to the channel. On this video, I want to talk about a bike that is on sale right now for a really good deal, I think. And so it is from Be Cool Bikes, if you've heard of them. They've been around for a while. This a particular model that I'm going to talk about has been out for about a year, I think, now. And it's called the, uh, <clears throat> as long as my voice doesn't give out on me here, it's called the Challenger. It's the Be Cool Challenger. Now this bike kind of looks to me, it kind of reminds me for some reason like a low rider motorcycle. Uh, anyway, it's a really nice looking bike in my opinion. I like this bike. I've um, had my eye on this bike in the past, but you know, uh, never did get serious about buying it or anything, but I did, uh, I have gone uh, looking at this bike uh, quite a bit when I was doing bike searches and stuff. But anyway, let me go over some of the, the specs on this bike. So there's two different options and the one I'm going to talk about is the one I think that I would probably go for in this particular uh, situation for the price. But anyway, so it comes in the option of 750 watt or a 1000 watt motor. Everything else is basically the same. Uh, the controllers are going to be a little bit different, but the uh, so the 750 watt is just that 750 watt and it peaks out at 1100 watts. And the other bike is a 1000 watt that peaks out at 1300 watts. And the controllers, the 750 watt has a 22 amp controller, whereas the 1000 watt motor has a 25 amp motor. Now these are 48 volt, I should mention, uh, bikes or uh, motors. So I'm gonna concentrate more on the 750 watt my bike because I think it's the better deal of the two and I'll I'll give you the prices in a little bit here after I run through the specs so besides the motor and the controller everything else is about the exact same right so let's go through and tell you some of the things uh, other things on the bike so the the battery this is the thing that really catches my eye besides the look of the bike the style I really like the style of bike but the battery, this battery is a 48 volt, 30 amp hour. So it's the gas tank style battery that sits right up here on the bus tube here, uh, on the top of the frame. Kind of like the uh, Super 73 do. And it really makes the bike look more like a motorcycle when they put the, uh, battery up there in the shape of a gas tank the downside to that i mean for looks wise i like that style but the downside to that is that you have to buy their battery if you're going to replace the battery right um i suppose you don't have to i shouldn't say that because you could you could fix it a different way that's more i should mention that that's more for the integrated frame so I think you can, the battery, disregard what I said there, because I don't think that's good. But anyway, so some other things about the bike, besides a 30 amp hour battery, so that's the other thing about the motor though, is that if you get the 750 watt motor, the battery's going to last you for a further distance. I think they said with pedal assist, the battery would go 110 miles on a charge, 80 miles throttle only. Now, uh, do I believe that? Absolutely, 100% no. I don't think you're going to get 80 miles on that as I see a rat go scampering by, or a mouse. I don't think you're going to get 80 miles uh, at all on that. And I don't think you're going to get 110 in pedal assist. But 
I don't have the bike and I don't know uh, the, if anybody's tested that um, but I just have a hard time believing even though it's a 30 amp hour battery I have a hard time believing that you would get that much uh, distance uh, the bike comes in two different color options black or red if you get the black the gas tank will be red and if you get the red the gas tank will be black but I think there are options I don't know if the 750 and the 1000 have this but they do have options for all black I don't know if they have all red or just all black but they do have that option uh, let's see what else it's got a full suspension hydraulic disc brakes the uh, wheel size is a little bit different it says the wheel size is 24 by 4 so uh, that's a little bit different I have seen that on some bikes you don't see that size as often but that is out there on some bikes um, you would think this bike would be more of a 20 by 4 the seat height is 31.6 inches uh, um, so that's not bad 31.6 if you're uh, a medium stature uh, that's probably pretty good if you're a little taller rider then that might be a little bit troublesome because the seat is not adjustable <clears throat> the bike does not come with fenders I think this particular bike wouldn't look as good I don't think with fenders I think it looks better probably without fenders but um, I probably would only want to ride that under dry conditions. I wouldn't want to be riding it in the wet because I wouldn't want to get wet any more than I'm getting wet already by riding, but that's just me. Um, I did not see the top speed of this bike. I should have looked at that. I failed to check out the top speed. I got to think it's going to go uh, for sure, uh, I'm pretty sure anyway, I think 28 miles an hour for the uh, 750 uh, and probably 30, 31 for the 1000 watt. Okay, I can't think of too many more things on this bike. Um, It's early in the morning when I'm shooting this video, so it's like quarter after five in the morning, so uh, my brain not, might not be awake yet to uh, give you all the... I might be missing a few specs. I think I got most of them, though. So, uh... Uh, let me see if I can remember anything else. Oh, there is one big thing I should mention. This is another big seller, hot seller for this bike, I think. It does come, for a limited time, they have a gift. And that is a folding cargo trailer. Free. Jeez, look at the garbage cans in the bike lane. Oh, I don't like that. And I don't know how long the... Uh, the limited time is it didn't say it just said limited time offer limited gift, gift uh, offer and the trailer is valued at $299 so pretty nice to get the trailer included so now let me give you the price on the bike so if you want the 750 watt bike that one's running for $1999 and regularly priced at $25.99 so for $1,999 that's why I think this one's the better deal so $1,999 will get you not only the uh, bike but like I say you'll get a utility trailer valued at $299 free um, a little cargo trailer so that would be uh, a pretty nice uh, add-on right there uh, 
free shipping, I believe. Well, maybe I shouldn't say that because I'm not positive, but I will leave a link in the description. I forgot to look at the uh, shipping. Most places ship for free, but I shouldn't say free shipping because I'm not sure. Uh, let's see, what else? Oh yeah, let me tell you the price of the 1,000 watt. So the 1,000 watt bike, the 1,000 watt bike is regularly priced at $27.99 and it's on sale for $24.99. So $2,500. So I think the better deal to me for that difference if the, if the other motor peaks out at 1100 watts, the 750 watt, and the 1000 watt peaks out at 1300 watts, that's not a whole lot of difference. The, the torque, I believe the torque was 80 newton meters on the 750, where it's, as it's 105 on the 1000 watts. So yeah, you're, you are going to notice that, I suppose. And, um, but the price is $500 difference. I still think the 750 watt, I think I'd save my $500, I don't know. I guess I'd want to get on one and try them and see what the difference is. But I know you can't do that when you're buying it online. So I don't know. I think, I still think the 500, the 500, or $600 off the 1999 is the better deal though. Anyway, I just thought I'd <clears throat> get that video out to you guys because I think this is a pretty good deal. This is a good bike. I like it. So if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you want to subscribe to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Thank you very much. And if you'd like to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, hit that notification bell. And you'll be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel. Tell your friends about us. we got a nice uh, number of videos now, well over 200 videos. So if you want to check out some of the past videos on the channel, we've got lots to look at there for... Um, different kinds of rides and talking about different kinds of bikes and some reviews and, and this and that so uh, go ahead and check it out if you would like to leave a comment on this video or any other videos go ahead and leave that in the comments section and once again thank you for joining me on this video I will leave a link in the description for the Be Cool Challenger. So until next time, take care.